I think my work is inspired by um, where I come from, Malawi. And in Malawi, we have a, a strong masking tradition called Nyao. And it's a very playful approach to life. In my work, play is very important. Play, creativity, I'm, I'm saying creative play. In the Biennale, I'm showing three works. And uh, the first one is, is the, one of the first works I made as an artist, the Holy Bowl I've told you, a football plus of the pages of the Bible, which people can exercise and exercise with. And this work is inspired by um, Michelangelo's Last Judgment, and where Christ is in the middle, a cosmic Christ, and there are figures around this. So for me in my work, this figure of Christ is represented by Holy Bowl, and I've brought 400 Holy Balls which will be released to the people over the Venisage. A hundred holy balls every day. And they will be out in the open before architecture and people can kick. I don't dictate what you do with the ball. I want to see, it's, it's an, a catalyst for creativity. And, uh, but uh, I want people to document what they are doing and share online. The other project that I have is uh, Sanguinetti Breakout Area, and it's based on an archive that uh, had uh, recently been bought uh, from an Italian situationist called uh, Gianfranco Sanguinetti. By the way, I'm interested in the situationists because they also put play and creativity at the center of their being, uh, of, uh, at the center of their way of looking at the world. So what I do, did was to go to Yale and photograph the whole archive and I brought it back to Italy. I would find photograph, the photographs and I would lift them up, play with them and create uh, a work of art right away. And actually when I was create, making this work, I, I shared it on Facebook. So I'm presenting it, it's on the wall, but there's also a huge book here that I've published called uh, Sanguinetti Thesis. And it's got, it, it documents as much as I could get out of Yale. Uh, I have all Sanguinetti's papers with me. A third project in the BNR, it's called Nyao Cinema. And when I was growing up, um, basically when the projectors that came into Malawi were edited to make the films more interesting, the boring bits would be cut, the conversation would be cut off. Or sometimes though, the films would last very briefly, maybe like 20 seconds, 30 seconds. This form of filmmaking in my work now, and also when I'm filming them, I'm inspired by this aesthetic of, of broken down film. The future for me is creativity, play, and cosmopolitanism, the world as one. United in play, in Nyao, if you like what we call in my tribe. Because when you play, it's universal. <laughs>